on the tour. We can also kind of talk about the area as well. So let's go ahead and, and get going. Some great curb appeal right there. You saw at the front, I'm just gonna pause it quickly, it was, it looks like it's a three car garage. This home is actually a four car garage. So you have a three car and then a tandem in one of them. These current sellers are utilizing that tandem as the gym, but it's definitely still a full four car garage, which is amazing. So room for all the toys and the cars in there too. You see the backyard space here. The house itself actually backs up to Citrus, which is that street that the high school is located on that we talked about. So you do have the ability, if you've got kids in high school, they can actually walk to school, which is great. Don't have to worry about that school traffic. Um, before we kind of keep going, I want to talk about the area and what is located nearby. So if you are familiar with Eastvale, you're familiar with that new brand new sports park, Silver Lakes Park. So you have a really great close proximity to that park here and also those soccer fields that are right there at the end of that street there. So you can go to the park, utilize that space as well. You're really close to shopping centers. You're kind of centrally located so you can access the Target that's there. We have a new Costco here in Eastvale. We have a new In-N-Out here in Eastvale. So you're really close to those as well. Very close to Albertsons, lots of restaurants, the movie theater. I would say less than two miles and you can access all of those great amenities nearby. So let me take you guys through the tour here as well and keep going for you. So there's that great curb appeal custom wrought iron fence here and painted concrete. This painted concrete you see in the backyard as well as this courtyard area too. So really great, nice feature, keeps it nice and clean looking all the time. What you see right here to your right is a double door entrance to that casita that we talked about with that separate AC, separate entrance, even a really great idea if you want to rent it out. I mean, a great way to maybe bring in some extra income every month. So really great opportunity with that casita here, a rare find and something that's hard to, to find. So there's the inside of that casita right here. Really great space with that AC capabilities. At this point, we've walked into the home. So if you see right here, that is your front door entrance. You open right up to the formal living room, which is very open to the living room and the dining room. And you've got these nice higher cathedral-like ceilings. So it feels great and grand here as well. So there's that open concept that we were kind of just talking about. Separate formal dining room. You will also see later on that there is a more casual dining as well. Here's that downstairs bathroom. That is actually a separate bathroom that is separate from the additional downstairs bedroom as well. So right here, we're in the main floor bedroom. So you've got the casita on the main floor and you've got that bedroom. So you've really got two main floor options, which is great. This main floor bedroom has its own full bathroom that's private. So even if you have guests coming in, they have access to a totally separate bathroom, which is great because then whoever's in this room has their own privacy. Ceiling fan in this room, you find ceiling fans in all of the rooms, which is great. Here's that full bathroom downstairs in that bedroom. And then of course here is the family room. Let's pause it right here. The family room, you notice this, these tile floors throughout most of it, except in the bedrooms. And then you have a laminate right here, which is great. It's really durable, great color, lasts long, you know, easy to clean, all that good stuff. This is your family room, which you'll see is open to the kitchen area too. So if you like to entertain, you can still be cooking in the kitchen and hanging out with your guests. Here's that big grand kitchen. So let's talk about some of the kitchen features that stay with the home. So the kitchen comes equipped with a built-in oven, built-in microwave, built-in stove, and a built-in refrigerator. So everything is built-in, custom to the home is staying here. You don't have to worry about bringing those appliances, so you are good to go on that. 
you've got this really great oversized island. This window right here actually opens to your backyard. I know I love that when you have that window where you can be doing your dishes and looking into your backyard. So great, nice feature right there too. Let's keep on going. You'll see the casual dining, which is separate from the formal dining, is right here off of the kitchen. So you do have that more casual space if you don't always want to be so formal. I know sometimes we're in a rush. It's just nice to kind of be in your casual dining space. Shutters here in this room as well. Great walk-in pantry. You also have your laundry room, which is on the main floor as well. Pause it right here. Right here is a custom medallion in the tile floor as well. So this is a great, nice custom feature. Makes that grand feeling up the circular staircase right here. So let's go on upstairs. Here we are open to the upstairs. And right here you see this is the loft area. They have actually equipped this loft area more as a theater room. So it comes with a projector. It comes with the screen that you can pull down. Those are all features that are gonna be staying with the home. So you can really keep up that theater feature here as well. We'll be able to actually show that function here shortly too of the theater. So there it is, that's their projector. They will be keeping that in the screen with the projector for the next buyer. So here is the master bedroom, which is huge. It comes with its own master retreat. So you can really utilize that space with a number of things on top of all the additional space that you already have. So space is certainly not an issue in this property. There's that retreat area here in the master. Some really great, unique custom paint too. Ceiling fan once again here in this bedroom. And here is the gorgeous master bathroom. You've got the separate tub and shower. Huge closet as well that they're gonna showcase. Separate sink, of course, because that's a necessity. And there is one of the other bedrooms located upstairs. Really great size too. You're not gonna have kids fighting over who's getting the bigger room because they are all a great size. Here is another one of the bathrooms. They actually, I'll pause it right here. They have two bathrooms that are both Jack and Jill for four of the bedrooms total. So each bedroom shares a Jack and Jill except for that downstairs bedroom that has its own private bathroom. There's that other bedroom through the Jack and Jill bathroom. Really great, cool, funky paint too, so. And you can see right here, there's the Jack and Jill that'll go to this other bathroom too, but they still each have separate sinks too. So they're not fighting over counter space or anything like that as well. So here's another bedroom up here. Super cute Parisian theme for your girls that like that. And here is the garage. I'm gonna pause it right here. So again, like I mentioned, the garage looks like it is a three car garage. It's actually a four car garage. And you can see that tandem garage right here. They're just using it as the gym space, like I mentioned, but definitely still have that ability to use it as the full four car garage, which is awesome. You probably saw in the front that you've got that nice bigger driveway too. So you really have good amount of space for all your vehicles and all of that fun stuff. Here is the backyard. I'll pause it so you guys can get a nice big look on it. Um, you've got the painted uh, cement down here, so it makes it look nice and clean. Super low maintenance, so you really don't have to worry about landscaping, paying for gardening and things like that. This backyard also comes equipped with a, an outdoor kitchen area. So they got the built-in barbecue. You see right here, that's the little sink in the corner right here. And then they have a, a little pergola overhang here for shady spots as well. So there's that built-in barbecue in the backyard.
shady pergola right there for you. This gives you a nice, big, expansive view. Oh, I'll pause it. I just missed it. But what we didn't go over was there is dual zoned AC. So really great, unique feature, helps save on some of those energy costs. So the upstairs is different AC control than the downstairs. And then the casita as well has its own AC control too. So really great feature with all of that. All right. So I just wanna make sure nobody has any questions about the property. The property itself is listed at 750. So you get all this great, amazing space. You even get that casita with the ability to maybe even bring in some extra income on that. All of that is for 750. So really great, unique property here in Eastvale. I'm gonna check the see if anybody has any questions that we can go over. Julia asked what the square footage of the lot is. It is 69.70. So nice big, the house itself is just over 4,400 square feet. Adriel commented low maintenance. You are absolutely right, which is awesome. You don't have to worry about gardening and all of that. Let's see if anybody else has questions on the home. Just wanna make sure we answer it. I think we answered all of them. I also want to just keep you guys posted to stay tuned. We're going to be doing another virtual open house of a property that we have located off of Selkirk in Corona. So great South Corona location. We're going to be hosting that at 1230. So if you guys know of anyone that is still looking to maybe buy or sell right now, we are actively looking at at you know, unique solutions to keep everybody going and keep real estate moving right now, even with everything going on. So hope you guys can all tune in at 1230 for another additional tour that we're going to be doing. Thanks so much and see you soon. Bye.